Hello folks, Gongju Lee here. Today, I'm gonna do something a little I haven't never done before. Which is basically do a, like, a proper, like, unboxing, like, review for color contacts. Or, so, I don't really know how to make a proper intro for this, so. <laughs> I'm really excited today to actually try on these color contacts. Like, I've never had color contacts before in my life. I've only had uh, regular contacts to see. Um, I got them when I was first uh, a little baby because <laughs> I was blind for all my life. And then I didn't wear them for a really long period of time and I didn't start wearing them again until last year. Earlier this year, I started cosplaying for the first time ever and I haven't looked back since I started. But I did realize that the more I get into cosplay, the more accurate or detailed I wanted to get with it. That would include changing the colors of my eyes without actually having to photoshop them into a different color, if possible. <laughs> so that's where color, my interest in color contacts came in. However, <laughs> I hit a snag and my eyes, uh, I have astigmatism in both of my eyes. So I just, I couldn't get just any regular like circle lens or color contacts or anything like that. I have to get like, if I'm going to go that route, I have to get tor color toric lenses. And I was shopping around and uh, the best sites that I ended up finding for my, you know, for my personal needs for finding toric lenses was uh, queencontacts.com. So I've never <laughs> purchased anything from them until today. But I purchased the Duba G, no BT, the Do, Du, Du, Dueba, Dueba, Duba, Du, D, D, U, E, Duba, Duba, Duba G, BT, Duba BT, Toric Grey lenses. Oh my gosh, that's so hard to say. Those are the lenses that I purchased, and I have it right here. Um, because they're Toric lenses, they have to be. Uh, it's especially made for my eyeballs. So I ordered them back at the end of September and I just got them now and it's the end of October. So it's about a month. It takes about 30 days. At least with queen.com. I, I heard some places may be a little quicker or some places may take a little longer. With my experience with uh, queencontacts.com it took about uh, 30 days. A l I think, I honestly think a little less. Oh, it wasn't 30 but maybe like 27. Look at that kind of thing. So, we're going to open it and see what's inside. I'm really excited. I was looking at the tracking thing all day today. Let's see what comes inside. We have this awesome user guide, which I'm very surprised it has, <laughs> it has pictures and stuff. And what I like about it most, it has like pictures and stuff in it. So that's, I think that's pretty dope. I didn't, I, I personally didn't expect pictures. So this is uh, not bad. It's good for a beginner. Or a person who has never had color contacts like me, so I'm really, I appreciate that effort. Also, it comes with this. It comes in this pretty little queen lens <laughs> uh, box. It's really dope. It's just all pink, you know. I think it's just not my color for now. <laughs> what is in the box are a proper contact case, like right here. Also comes with. Uh, proper pizza. And of course, the Chris de la Resistance. My contacts. So the, the color contacts will be, um, I don't know, will be coming in this, uh, these kind of bottles. I've never had contacts come in these kind of bottles before, but you can see right here on the side, I think, hopefully, focus in. You can see on the side it says Duba and it's the zone and has you know hunger on the side because I bought it <laughs> I bought it from South Korea but what's awesome is that on the top you can tell which one is uh, which one is yours so as you can tell I'm blind as a bat let's actually try these on we want to actually follow the instructions that was provided so it says how very good it says this how do our contact? I hate that it doesn't autofocus. <laughs> but okay, so let's do everything uh, step by step. Step one, wash your hands. Hands have been washed. I got prepared. Step two, place a lens on your right 
index finger. <laughs> so I have the right one. We're gonna uh, open it up. It doesn't seem to be a twist, it's more like a, like a cap thing on top of it. That's fucking fun. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> that's fun! No, that's not a good idea. I broke it. <laughs> we're gonna get creative in regards to how to f***ing open this shit. Okay. I didn't break it! I, I just- I took the thing- I uh, guess- I just- okay, I didn't break it. Yay me. Okay. I'll take off my glasses. And you can see that I have particularly- I don't know if it's like lighting, but you can see that I have like particularly like really dark uh, brown eyes. So like the um, Duba BT gray torque lenses are hopefully would help see <laughs> that come out. Okay. So I wash my hands with the lens, place uh, something on your forefinger. Okay, here we go. Okay, so I think this is what I like, to get it. This I think this is what the pincers are for. I think. Don't don't quote me on that. I'm 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 I'm, I'm trying to get the liquid out. Okay, okay, it doesn't say any way about guys how to get the goddamn lenses out. So here we go. Right index finger, and you can see that I have it like I have it like curved up like that. So that's how I know it's like on the like the right way. So my right eye. Oh my god, I can't see <laughs> it's so hard to like use the camera as a mirror. I don't do that at all. <laughs> I think it's in, it doesn't fall out, and I can see out of my eye. So dope. <gasps> oh my gosh! It looks like I have awesome eyes. Look at that. Look at that. Alright, let's try the next. Let's let's complete the look. Let's get this one out. Without without breaking it. <laughs> oh, that is what's supposed to happen. Okay, so it's it, it looks it, it comes out like this, right? I'm like it's I'm struggling with it. And then it's like a, a foil thing that pops up, like like this, that comes up. And you gotta like peel it as you peel and you, you do this the thing, the thingy, <laughs> and you peel it off. You see what I mean? You just you peel the shit off. Okay. All right. And then <laughs> left eye commence. It didn't feel like it fell out. <gasps> oh, look at me! <gasps> oh my goodness! I have great eyes, y'all. This is what I would look like if I had bright eyes. <gasps> if I came into work like this, with like my eyes all like bright and like everything else was the same, they'd be like, "What happened with your like? There's something off about you, Gongjuli. What? What's wrong with you? Or why? What, what's something about you looks a little different?" And I'm like. Oh, really? What oh, looks so different about me? <laughs> Sorry, I got a little carried away. I'm just super psyched. It looks so good, and I totally can see the color. Like, oh, I my eyes. Oh, there we go. As you can see. Like if we, I'll I'll do like like it's compared to like the dark, and I have like dark, like brown eyes. So for like these lenses to like actually bring out like color, it's super awesome. And for the, it's super clear right now to me. Like I'm so happy I can see. So like that was like my main concern in regards to the torque lens. Like yeah, the color may be there, but if I can't see out of it, there's like no point because then I'm gonna be wearing my glasses anyway. So oh my gosh, you guys. <laughs>
<laughs> I am way more hyped about this than I really should be, but I'm very happy about how they turned out. Oh my gosh, so great, so nice. We're just going like this all day, like, my eyes, look at my eyes, I dare you. Ah. But then I have to like do like some kind of like like uh, production, so I'll be have to I can use my like quote unquote. Gonna lens. <laughs> Dude, I look cute as f Look at that. Adorable. Look at my eyes. Look at my eyes. <laughs> so if I can do like a final, let me, final review. So I was very, 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 hesitant about purchasing color lenses, like circle lenses and all that, but like, because of my astigmatism that I have in both of my eyes, I was extremely hesitant about buying colored, like, toric lenses, which is what I need in order to, like, change the color of my eyes and shit. But, oh my goodness, I'm so glad I, like, I took the leap, <laughs> and I, uh, I actually made a purchase with, uh, again, at queenscontact.com. Uh, it's, it's, I don't really know how to explain it. I, was, it. I had certain expectations for it, and I'm glad that it not only met my expectations in regards to the worries that I had, but it also, like, the, the particular lenses that I purchased, like, again, the ones that I got are called Duva BT, the Toric gray ones, and I picked these ones because I was, I'm going to, like, cosplay uh, A2, and she has, like, bright blue eyes, but I looked at the blue ones and I'm like, I don't, I don't think I need that. I just, I think these gray ones are like dope. And I've always wanted like gray eyes. So like, now that I know how bright these are, I know it's safer for me to go like, oh, I'll, at least I want to try it to kind of go a little darker to give it more of a uh, <laughs> natural, I guess, look, more like natural gray eyes or something like that. And then it makes me give, like, I, I keep looking here because I look at me and I'm like, adorable. I, you look at my face and you're like, that is one big girl. Let me holler at her. <laughs> like, I'm really excited that this gave me uh, encouragement or conf like, uh, yeah, confidence that it's okay to like kind of experiment with other um, toric lenses in different colors. <laughs> I highly, rec I highly recommend for sure to do your research, to do your homework, to check out all the sites, check out what colors you want in regards to your eye color irises. If you have really dark eyes like I do, you have to take that into consideration in regards to if the color will actually show up or be reflected, or if you have really light eyes, you know, that, I don't I, I don't know how that is, but just I'm talking, you should take that into consideration, the actual natural color of your iris. Um, and then not only just do your research about what color would be good for you, which one do you want, and it's just which company would have like, you know, that works with you in regards to, oh, um, tracking your package, you know, are they access easily accessible in case something goes wrong, I need to contact their support, or is there a return policy, like, etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. So doing your homework ahead of time will save you a hassle and you will end up with a perfect, <laughs> awesome experience like I did, um, especially since initially I was a very hesitant buyer and very uh, um, skeptical. Oh, I will give Queen Contacts a uh, 5 out of 5. <laughs> I don't even know. I don't have a rating system. I'm just really fucking happy with <laughs> my contact ones. I look adorable. And they're gray. You can tell they're gray. And then like in like light, in like the bright lights right here, like I know it shines off a little bit as blue, but like that's the look I'm going for for like my cosplay. And I know like once it's darker, like see look, if, you, if I put shade over my eyes, like it looks it looks normal so if i look it, it's the door i look cute you guys <laughs> i really i'm like everyone keeps like they're like oh man what's that what's that exotic look of yours like why do you look like that I'm like oh man what, what what do you mix with i'm gonna get a shit more ton of those questions now because of the color contacts <laughs> so if you want those kind of questions or you know just want to experiment with your look and you know with all yourself up or is for cosplay like the reason why I got them I would definitely recommend uh, queencontacts.com especially especially if you have astigmatism in your eye 
<laughs> in your eye or eyes um, because they definitely have a, uh, a wide range of colors you can choose from. I know for uh, people who have astigmatism, color contacts, the variety of what you can use is rather limited. It, I mean, if, even if you have astigmatism, you, I know you can get regular circle lenses, which out, that doesn't, you know, whatever, it, whatever, however, but, you know, I hear a lot of stories in regards to how it, it doesn't stay in your eye, or, like, you dry, I mean, all these contacts are probably soon dry out really fast, or whatever, but, like, it just, there's a lot more hassle in it than it needs to be, whether if you just got, like, specific contacts, which are the same, which are the color that you desire, and design for your eyeballs, because of the astigmatism in your eyeballs. <laughs> So um, just save the hassle and definitely go for comfort and convenience and safety of your eyes, um, which I know for a lot of people, if you're money tight or you're strapped with cash like me, you're a little wary about like reviews or stuff like that. But I am letting you know as someone who works that, you know, that nine to five and I'm like paycheck to paycheck paying for all my other bills and I'm like, I'm trying to do this expensive ass hobby known as cosplay and I'm like oh hey I want to do color contacts but oh shit I have astigmatism in my eyes what the fuck am I gonna do oh you can get toric lenses oh well how much are toric lenses because I see all these regular ass circle basic ass circle lenses for like ten dollars oh if you because you have astigmatism because you have lousy eyesight or nature or whatever the fuck you want to blame this shit's gonna cost you sixty bucks uh what <laughs> so but I'm telling you that money, that extra money that you spend to like have it designed specifically for the, the level of extensiveness that you have, will be so much, much more of a comfort and a relief in the long run. Definitely, before before everything, go to your optometrist. <laughs> like, go to your eye doctor, get your like prescription updated, and get a bloody prescription. <laughs> I was like, you only get one set of eyes. <laughs> And we are not that far along in uh, the future to replace our eyeballs. So it's really, really, really important to take care of them um, because you only get one. Basically, that's, 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 that's it. There's no I hope you guys enjoyed uh, my uh, Queen Contacts <laughs> uh, Toric, Color Toric Lens Review. Um, the one that I particularly uh, reviewed today is Duba BT uh, Toric Gray Contact Lenses. And I'm super happy with them. Um, so yeah, I plan on buying more, like, cosplay stuff in the future, and especially from vendors, because I, one, I'm, I'm not talented yet, so uh, as a budding cosplayer, I understand, like, I, you, the, the, some budgets and shits you gotta, like, <laughs> work with, so, it, and if you're the type of cosplayer that likes to buy and build their cosplay through, like, buying through Amazon or these other like third party vendors or another website or like other stuff like and just other things like I'm in that same boat so if you like me to like do more of those kind of reviews for you guys well, I'm more than happy to because I know when I'm in that same situation well the first thing I do is I look for fucking reviews and I'm like oh how does this person like handle it or hey you know I know this person bought this but what about how it works on me blah 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 <laughs> but yeah anyways so if you like what I, I do and you, you enjoy me with my, my mild entertainment and my kookiness or whatever, please do hit that follow button, uh, subscribe, share, like, and whatever, all the videos. I'm not really good at this in regards to self-promoting myself, but I do want you to share this with other people who are in the same position as I was, who I hesitate about buying color contacts and a little skeptical because they have astigmatism. I really hope this review helps you out in regards to, you know, leading you one way towards the other. You'd be like, oh, you know what? Toric lens is, you know, it's not really that, not for me at this time. Or, hey, you know, this is exactly what I needed to hear. You know, I'm, I want to go purchase Toric lenses. Like, she had a positive, uh, you know, experience with it. She did her homework and, she, you know, she's giving me an honest review about her experience. I'm, I'm sold. Let me go get my own. So, um, yeah. Here I am, going to leave, being helpful as possible. New cosplayer stuff, 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 stuff. Please come back for the next video, and I will see you soon. Thank you so much for tuning in and giving me the view, and I hope that uh, my review does help you out. Real talk. All right. Until next time, my name is Gong Julie, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye. -bye.